Okay, we're coming live from Bendigo. We're speaking to Madeline, a true, uh, I guess, performer when it comes to, I mean, like, uh, what's that course again you're doing? Visual communications. Visual communications. I used to do graphic design. It's called visual communications now, is it? Okay. Mm -hmm. And your project um, was to what? I had to design something that's going to make Melbourne attractive to youth and sort of get more people into the city. Okay, so everybody had to have that, that one brief? Uh, no, that no. was just, we had to come up with the briefs ourselves. Yeah. yeah, so you started off with designing the brief and now you've come up with an idea of sort of attracting people to Melbourne yeah. and helping them get around a bit. Yeah. And also um, when they're getting around, you know, how to get around. Yeah. Okay. Now, you've come up with a logo, an app, and also almost like a booth style thing. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now, you got a bit excited, didn't you? Yeah, I did. Okay, what was the big turning point? Um, big turning point was probably when I came to talk to you. Oh, come on. You can't say that. Augmented reality. Really? You're lying. <laughs> no. Really? <laughs> okay. So, augmented reality, you've incorporated into your portfolio, have you? Yeah. All right. Well, give us a little whirlwind. Show us what you did. Well, tell us, tell us the process So, before you get straight into it. So we look out for a letter, yep. and then you hold your phone over it, yep. and then it does it, it augments the page, does it? Yeah, plays the video, and if there's a link to a website, like if there's a possible link to a website, it'll send you to the website mm. by tapping on it. And All right, well, let's, let's have a sneak preview. As well as these two clients that I've mentioned here, the other client that I will be focusing on... So we've got the video playing here? Yeah. And I can double so double tip that. Yep. Basically, what the so and double the tap it. That I'm designing will be for. Um, as well as these two. I'll do that for you. No, yeah. And then so it'll send yeah, um, to the website of Visitor Information Centre. Now, I, crazy stuff. I'm like, and I, I live and breathe this stuff, so I've seen a lot of that. But what did your teacher say? when you submitted an assignment with augmented reality into it. The teacher said she's never seen anything like it before. She thought it was so cool. Yeah, and I also heard that all the other students came around and checked it out. Oh, yeah. not yet. I haven't told them that I'm doing it yet. Oh, so it's just Keeping your, it to myself. Okay, so it was your teacher that loved it. <laughs> yeah. And then when the other students see it, one would assume that this may become almost a norm or expected maybe next year. Yeah, I'd say so. So you're paving the, you're paving the way. Yeah. Raising the bar. Yeah. All right, well, good luck. Um, when do you finish year 12? Um, next year. Next year? Oh, so you're in year 11 doing yeah. a year 12 subject. Yeah. Bam. <laughs> um, and what school? Catholic College. Catholic, Catholic College in Bendigo. Well, there you go. So uh, when I was in school, we were learning DOS. Uh, kids are now learning augmented reality. It's frightening stuff. So, uh, yeah, well done, Madeline. I'm glad I was a little bit of a part of your journey. It was great. Thank you so much. Quite all right. Cheers.